I'm going into Whole Foods to get some dinner and maybe, maybe I will meet the man of my dreams. This is the place you need to be frequenting to find us from Matilda Open. I always say I'm going to meet my husband at the Whole Foods Olive Bar because that's such a green flag. Like he knows like fancy little hors d'oeuvres snacks. Okay, ladies, I think I cracked the code on where to find really hot guys. Whole Foods, they were everywhere. So I just went to Whole Foods. Mind you, I live in Tribeca where there's a lot of hot men. Today, we are going to Ikea. Now, I know what you're thinking. You're thinking there aren't any single... Is Whole Foods a place to meet people? I go every single day looking like this. And I must say, the men, I'm attracted to men, are very good looking. And Whole Foods, it kind of has me thinking I should uh, not go in, in sweats. Thirsty much? It's literally the most beautiful man I've ever seen. Um... I'm probably not going to talk to him because I'm a nervous wreck, but, um, oh, Lord. I want y'all to stop acting like fine single men just be everywhere. Y'all be like, you never know. You might meet him at the grocery store. I ain't never seen a fine single man at Trader Joe's. Ever. I ain't never seen a fine single man at Publix. Ever. The boys be Instacarted. They don't be at the grocery store. Okay, I just have to show you guys this. Like... I have to go return some Amazon things at Whole Foods and I'm like, oh, maybe I'll find the love of my life dressed like this. I'm also going to go for a walk, but I'm like, what? try harder, but I can't be bothered. <laughs> have a great Saturday. <laughs> and maybe, you know, if you find the love of your life, wearing no makeup and looking like a literal troll good for you couldn't beat me how just walked to whole foods did some grocery shopping and like obviously living in new york you want to like romanticize every second of your life so i'm like oh my gosh what if i met my husband over in whole foods over rose and like fucking asparagus you need help a la cody co um but then i realized i am wearing this a turtleneck, oversized, and grey set pants. And I don't look cute, but my hair looks good actually, so it's all that matters. So I'm going into Whole Foods to get some dinner and maybe, maybe I will meet the man of my dreams. I put on some pink lipstick. Wish me luck. Stop! Okay ladies, I think I cracked the code on where to find really hot guys. I was doing a Sunday reset because that's what everybody here does. and. Whole Foods, they were everywhere. And I literally was shopping and I was like, oh my God. Like, should I come here on Sundays more often? Specifically, if you're from Boston, Whole Foods Ink Block was Chef Kiss. Bonus, um, I'm 5'2", so I can't reach anything. And obviously the Olipop was the top shelf. I could not reach it. So I had to ask a very nice tall man and he was cute. And he had a nice laugh about it. So if you're short, definitely go there. But if you're not, also go there too, obviously. Disclaimer, the parking lot's a mess, so like, um, you're gonna have to wait in line to get in. It's like a club. I always say I'm gonna meet my husband at the Whole Foods Olive Bar, because that's such a green flag. Like, he knows, like, fancy little hors d'oeuvres snacks, and he's packing little boxes. I'm like, that's my husband. Honey, see you looking at me. I'm ready to go in. You need help. I swear to God, I must have been like an NFL player in a former life, the way I've... Dodge and weave through motherfuckers trying to talk to me <laughs> when I'm just out. Like, damn. I really was just trying to pick up stuff for William's school from Whole Foods. And it's like, and came up to me asking if I knew where the veggie trays were. How the fuck am I gonna know? I don't know where the vegetables are. Like, damn. I was just like, I'm sorry, I don't work here. Like, I didn't know what else to say. So, your beautiful blonde hair, I'm like, okay, thank you. I gotta go. <laughs> Please just let me shop in peace. You don't want any of this. Trust me. Listen, my baggage, the baggage that I come with, you would need a whole fucking airport, okay? So let's just relax. I'm not what you think I am. Walk the other direction. Thank God I'm like 25 feet tall. You know, I take two steps, I'm already a million feet away from them. So it's not that big of a deal. I can outrun them very quickly, but men are so thirsty. Oh my God. Relax. Dressed up for husband hunting in Whole Foods. Wish me luck.
Balls hanging low while a pop a bottle of your chain swinging clang clang and it costs a lot. Bitch, I'm always at the. I think I just had a spiritual awakening in Whole Foods. Holy shit. I'm the kind of girl that's like, time is money. And to save time, I get Instacart. I haven't been in a grocery store in a year. In other words, I'm lazy. I I'm better off doing other things. But today, I went to the post office. I was in my car. I was like, no, Jamie, get up, go to Whole Foods. Holy shit. Whole Foods is full of organic, fine ass men. A lot of bubble butts and, and work attire I saw. I was ready to get in there like it was my last meal. You go at noon, everyone's lunch break. You go to the salad section where everyone's waiting for their prepared foods. I'm there waiting for a man. I'm waiting for a husband. I'm gonna have some wine. I'm gonna put up a little beach chair in the wine section right there and I'm gonna take my pick. This is a sign for all the lazy people who've been ordering Instacart. Fuck Instacart. Go to the grocery store. You're gonna get married. Hey, sorry, quick question. Are you looking for a wife? What? Are you looking for a wife? Like, what do you mean? Like, just like a wife. Like, get married. Whatsoever, I'm not going to get married. On today's episode of What Did You Buy at Whole Foods While Looking Cute Trying to Meet a Husband? These six items cost me $43. And I did not meet a husband. been a minute since I've been to Whole Foods and it's actually been a minute since I've actively looked for love so I thought I would grab myself a beautiful kale salad maybe some fresh fish and peruse the aisles for a little love so wish me luck I am so ready for love I'm so ready I'm so ready universe universe Whole Foods shoppers in the parking lot I'm ready for love Stop. I did it, y'all. I did the thing where the delivery man's like, hold up, let me take a picture. And I posed for it. I got down. I posed for it. <laughs> and that delivery man was very attractive. Oh, he was. And he had an accent, too. <laughs> wow. It's too bad I look so crusty, but cute. He was probably the love of my life. I might have to order from Ikea again. Ikea, sir, I forgot to shoot my shot. But I'm re I'm ready now. Well, I'm not ready. Now. Trust me, when I take a shower, I'm adorable. I'm hilarious. I built this IKEA item here by myself. Also, I am an adult. That is a gray eyebrow hair. So listen, if you were my IKEA delivery guy and you were, you know, interested in my charm and adorableness, uh, and you're single and you want to go on a date sometime, you will never see this. But if you do, <laughs> he was so cute. It's cuffing season and all the girls be needing. Need a big boy. I want a big boy. Give me a big boy. I want to kiss you. But if I do, then I might not be brave.